All right, so check out what we found today. This is a bracket or shelf fungi. Beautiful, beautiful specimen growing all along this willow branch and it's starting to die, a little distressed. This is where you're usually gonna find your mushrooms. Now, characteristically, you can kind of tell why they're named this. They have that beautiful horizontal growth. Uh, we wanna see this in a very healthy forest. You wanna see a very good diversity of mushrooms. Now. As far as reproductive, how do they get here? If you look on the underside, what you're gonna notice are literally hundreds of these gill-like structures. And each of these contains hundreds of millions of spores. These are all potential offspring. And due to their very, very unique reproductive cycles, they can let these spores out for months at a time for a grand totals of over a trillion potential offspring. Uh, these are not short-lived fungi. Depending on their circumstance, if their food source stays, they can live for 40, 50, 60 years. They have recorded evidence of these things living, depending on kind of their genus, species, and again, circumstance. As far as the food source, there are so many different types. You need to do some research. Most of these are not edible. Uh, always when you're consuming fungi as a human, be very cautious because some of these are really able to mess you up. But cool find. We'll go look at a couple dead ones or ones that have been around for quite a few years. They are quite, quite unique and very beautiful and neat to find in our forests. So we'll go see them. All right, so here are some of your old shelf or bracket fungi. And these, once they get to the size, are referred to as conchs. Uh, although this guy is coming to the end of its lifespan, when they're younger, still about this size, they are so attached on there that you can literally use these as foot and handholds if you're trying to climb up some trees. And if you look up this hackberry, you can kind of tell that they're spaced out like a rock climbing wall. So if you've got to get up there, this might be one of your avenues. Nice find. You'll see these in various stages of their life all throughout the old growth forests. They're all part of the cycle breaking down our wood, but cool find. These guys are old. Will it climb? Old dead conks. And that's why you don't climb the dead ones.